Anonymous Watch Guy here with another quick unboxing video. Wrist check wearing the G Shock Foggy Forest Edition. Did an unboxing on that one the other day. Today I have a brand that, uh, this is my first experience with this brand. It is an Audaz. Uh, and this is a micro brand. I believe they are in Hong Kong. Uh, somewhere in that region comes in this nice cool little uh, zip pouch here uh, Inside the pouch we have the watch we have an extra strap rubber strap got some warranty card information Standard kind of stuff and then we have the watch now this is an Audes Marine Master. Uh, this kind of looks a little Tag Heuer Aqua Racer-ish with the kind of um, shape of the case and bezel there. Uh, this is a rather large watch. Uh, this is a 44 millimeter watch. Uh, it is 53 millimeters lug to lug. Uh, it is 15 millimeters thick. This is a 300 meter water resistant watch. It does have a helium escape valve. So this is a little bit of a big boy. Um, nice blue kind of sun ray dial there. Uh, does have a, a screw down crown at the three o'clock position signed with the Audes logo. Uh, it is a sapphire crystal with inner AR coating. Uh, this is a ceramic bezel insert on this bad boy as well. Some bezel action here. That is a stiff bezel and it is a little bit hard to grip. bezel on that. Not the world's greatest bezel action, but it is not horrible. Lines up good there. Um, nice looking watch, like kind of the orange on the minute hand, the orange on the second hand, kind of the lollipop on the end there. Got your Audes logo at 12 o'clock. Marine Master Automatic, 300 meters. Uh, this is a Seiko NH35 movement, uh, pretty standard movement there. Really like the look of the watch, so I kind of like this case shape, uh, kind of a shark mesh, maybe style, you'd call it, uh, bracelet, um, it's like... How does this clasp work? Well, it's just a kind of a pressure clasp, milled out. Uh, kind of the star of the show to me on this watch, though, is the case back. On this case back, you have a really cool kind of blue, uh, for, you know, kind of ocean color there, and you've got a blue whale and her calf uh, really really cool case back uh, one of the coolest i've seen uh, especially on a watch at this price point full retail on this watch is 425 us dollars so this is a very affordable watch uh, i did not pay anywhere near that i actually got it on an online forum uh, for just a little over 200 US dollars. So I got quite a good deal on this. You can find them for less than retail, but that case back is very cool. Um, but this shark mesh, kind of shark mesh is what I call it, style bracelet, feels pretty good. Uh, you got a signed uh, kind of buckle there or, or the, where the clasp is. You've got, it looks like a metal floating keeper and a rubber floating keeper here. Um, so there's also a rubber strap included. 
but you know, a decent quality feel on this mesh bracelet. Um, the finishing on the case isn't too shabby. You got some nice brushing there. Kind of a polished bevel there on the, uh, uh, around the bezel. Uh, that ceramic insert looks good there uh, on the bezel itself. Kind of a nice looking sunray finish to that dial. Uh, like the color contrast. I think it's a pretty sharp looking watch. Um, again, it is a really a pretty large watch. If uh, you've got a smaller wrist, this one may not be for you. It's a thick, thick watch and a, uh, a, a bigger watch. But uh, if you're looking for a you know affordable micro brand uh, diver, this isn't a bad option. It's definitely got some cool features so uh, if you like the video give me a like uh, maybe subscribe to the channel but uh, there you have it the audaz marine master